Atlas. Persona 3, Dancing in Moonlight. Oh, you're awake. Are you okay? No clue. We woke up here. Maybe we should just go back to sleep. Maybe you should just sleep forever. Everyone else is here too. This place is strange. It doesn't make any sense. I went to sleep in my own room. As did I. When I woke, I was here with the others. Everyone's here. Could this be an attack? Yamagishi, do you have an understanding of the situation? There are no signs of shadows. It seems we're safer now, but... Huh? What the... Ladies and gentlemen! I have been waiting for you. Welcome to the Velvet Room. <clears throat> I mean... For one night only, a magical paradise where a gathering of passionate souls revel as one! Welcome to Club Velvet! Whoa, that was unexpected. I mean, what's going on here? Who are you? That was merely an ingenious orchestration of a dazzling entrance. No big deal. Uh, you're calling yourself a genius? Whatever, she's such a hottie. You know her? No way! When did you meet her? But that means she's not an enemy, right? Well, what do you want with us? Ah, uh, yes. Allow me to explain. However, I will not answer any more questions until I am done. She... she's kind of overbearing, huh? You think we're gonna be okay? Due to an incident involving my sisters, we shall be holding a ball here. Accordingly, I have summoned you all to proudly participate in the festivities. A ball? You mean, like a party? Ooh, sounds like fun! I'm totally down for that! Hold on, Yuri. This doesn't seem like just any old party. What do you want us to do? Ah, yes! Thank you for asking. I would like for you, my guests, to dance for me! Dance? What? 
there's no need for rumination. It's as simple as following your heart and releasing your passion on stage. Uh, it doesn't sound simple. Sorry, but we don't have time for this. Ah, uh, there's no need to worry about that. In the real world, you are all fast asleep. What happens here will only take place tonight, and then it will vanish like a fleeting dream. Regardless of how much time you spend here, it will not have any effect on reality. Um, so since we're in a dream, we can spend as long as we want here, and it won't matter? Yes, perfectly stated. In addition, once you wake in the real world, your memories from this place will all be removed. It will be quick and painless, allowing you to rise and shine just like any other morning. So please enjoy your time here to your heart's content. That's easy for her to say. Does she really expect us to go along with this? Why must we dance, though? You need to give us a reason. Why, you ask? Hmm, well... currently on a very dark journey. I can only imagine how stressful it must be. I apologize for my audacity, but I only wish to provide you with some relaxation. Thus, I prepared such an occasion to lift your spirits for the days to come. Will this explanation suffice? You just thought of that, didn't you? Should you refuse me, I would have no one else to turn to. I would be unable to even the score with my incompetent sister for all of eternity. And without a doubt, my dignity would be trampled in the mud. Your sister? Oh, don't let it trouble you. That is truly a personal affair after all. Anyway... I thought I had done my utmost to support this man's journey from the shadows. Yet to think you won't even oblige one teensy little request from me. However, the blame rests solely with me. My sadness is deeper than the color of this room. Hey, she's crying. Those are obviously crocodile tears. She's attempting to appeal to our emotions. Uh, however, her acting lacks any true sentiment. What are we gonna do? You're indebted to her, right? Then she's an ally. And if that's the case, we can't turn our backs on her. I'm okay with it. What about you guys? I don't mind either. It's not like I have any strong objections. Wait, what? You're actually okay with dancing? <laughs> you have all accepted my terms, yes? A guest never goes back on their word, so our contract has been sealed. Now then, I ask that you all dance passionately into your heart's content. I knew it. She didn't even try to hide how quickly her mood changed. But I didn't agree to it. First off, none of us have any dance skills or techniques. What will be done about that? Not to worry, as I am well aware. Club Velvet is a mysterious space that only exists within your dreams. Your emotions will be transformed into dance moves, enabling your body to move exactly how you imagine it to. It's merely child's play here. <sighs> she completely has the upper hand. It seems we've fallen right into her trap. Fine by me. Sounds fun. And basically, we just have to dance and rile up the crowd, right? Um... Uh... Oh, I beg your pardon. It seems I forgot to introduce myself. The one who will be guiding... No, <laughs> producing you is me. My name is Elizabeth. Please feel free to call me by my nickname, LP. Fine, whatever. So then, what do we need to do? Please tell us in more detail, uh... LP? Yes, just as Kenny Boy said, we're pressed for time here. Permit me to wrap things up and get right to the point. Uh, he didn't say that. And what's with the forced use of idioms? A 
shall gracefully forego the insignificant details and tell you about Club Velvet. First, this room you are in now is the VIP room, exclusively for your private use. Please utilize it as you wish, be it to practice or to chat with one another. Oh, so this isn't where we'll be performing? The dance floor where you will actually perform is located just outside this room. The images in a dancer's heart will create the stage on which they'll perform within reason. Within reason? That sounds scary coming from her. In addition, I have prepared a separate waiting room for each of you. Yo, for real? <laughs> We're like celebrities! To ensure that your waiting rooms will have a most relaxing effect on you, I have created each one to reflect the very rooms in which you spend your daily lives. I'll give you your key so that until it's time to perform, you can relax whole heart. No, whole wheat? Whole, whole grain? Well, whatever. Relax how you would like. Our rooms? You mean our dorm rooms? Good. Then I can train. You're accepting this way too easily, senpai. Plus, what's the point of training in a dream? Now then, as leader of the dance team, please get this party started. Wait, what? You're our leader here, too? That's fine with me. You're best suited, after all. Go ahead. Herself. Guess we'll just have to give this a go. By the way, I'm ready whenever. I'm still a bit lost, but I'll make sure to be ready too. We'll look to you, leader. Yo, Does I'm anyone have any this. intel? Yes, oh, this this is very own. interesting. Not, why don't we check out our waiting rooms?
Shadow Door Mass Destruction. Oh, yeah. What to do? Oh, it's you. I understand that we can dance here just by imagining it. I've been trying it out myself. However, I've never danced in a setting like this before. Straightforward, huh? Well, you're basically correct. I've never dealt with this sort of thing. The closest would be ballroom dancing. And even that's an overstatement. I only learned the basics to perform on the floor. Thus, I have no confidence in riling up the crowd as we were instructed. So you think I should just go with the flow? Perhaps that's all I can do. Then I'll give it a try. Turning my back on this would be a disgrace as a Kirijo. I swear on my family's name to make the crowd's cheers all mine. Quite. If I were to falter now, putting on a great show would be beyond my wildest dreams. I'll be sure to reference everyone's dancing. Sorry, but I'll need your help when I do so. All right then, time to pull myself together and get to practicing. You'll join me, no? Destruction. Okay, I've got this. I'll do this calmly. Looks like it's beginning. Time to watch. How's that? Great. Yes! Wow! How's that? Great! That's it! Ready to go anytime! Yes! How's that? Wow! Yes! Great. That's the way! And That's it! Say huh? Perfectly in sync! Say Say How's that? Your brilliance on stage was top-notch as well. I could feel your passion, Mitsuru Senpai. I'm loving it. That was intense, but really fun. Thank you. Whoa. Yes. Great. How's that? That's it. Whoa. How's that? Huh? I'm starting to get fired up here. Yeah, I'm getting hyped. Finally here. Now's my chance. Absolutely amazing. Yes. That's it. I'm stepping in. Looking good. Whoa, you look perfect. All that training's really showing results. Woohoo! 
Either. You have remarkable talent, just as I thought. Ready, let's begin! Whoa, you look serious, Yucatan. Sound the bell. Now come on, like always, Akihiko Senpai. Nailed it. <laughs> what 
Practice too? Greetings, leader. I've just concluded practicing as well. I guess your dancing is so amazing. I feel even more inspired now. Fuka-san, you seem happy being here. Your expression is more carefree than usual. Oh, yes. Dancing with everyone has been great. It's like we get our own little school club. I've only ever been in liberal arts clubs, so I've always dreamed of joining a sports club. I'm ready to cheer on everyone! Huh? Oh no, I'll try to dance too! But I'm not great at physical activities. So I thought I might help more as a support. Even if that is the case, isn't this situation optimal for your attempts? According to LP, our bodies will perform any dance moves exactly as we imagine them. Thus, even if you lack talent in physical activities, such an issue is no matter here. Well, I guess that's true. My assessment 
is that the only necessity for your successful dancing is self-confidence. You previously mentioned that you consider dancing to be fun, like a club activity. You should then consider this place as our dance club, with yourself as its president. Me, the president? Uh, I don't think I could do it. The title is merely a presumption, but this will allow you to achieve your dream. Well, that's true. You're right. It'd be much more difficult to do it any time besides now. All right, I'll do my best for the Dance Cheer Club. Oh, of course I'll dance, but I also really want to cheer everyone on as they perform. I've been providing support whenever we went to Tartarus and dealt with shadows. So I want to use my strongest skills and help everyone while we're here, too. It's true that dancers try harder if they are being cheered on. That sounds like fun. Then it's decided. I hereby elect myself president of the Dance Cheer Club. <laughs> Thanks. I guess it is a bit daring for my usual self. After all, we are in a dream. This might not be the best way to put it, but... Since we'll forget everything when we wake up, I'd rather go and try new things. In that case, one must strike while the iron is hot. I will now resume practice, so please cheer me on, Fuka-san. All right. I'll do my best. I'll get ready at once. I'll give it a try. Keep calm, Fuka. This is starting to be fun. Oh, yeah. I did it.
mit Sirius M. Kai Sit Fantastie. Oh, yeah. Are you going to practice? I was just about to discuss something with LP. I am an anti-shadow weapon. I was born for the purpose of fighting. I'm glad that someone such as myself can partake in a peaceful activity like dancing. Thank you for inviting me. I will do my very best. Please, this is a ball. Let us dispense with such formalities. You need to get peaced out, I guess, and display your explosive vibes at full force. If you require anything for that purpose, please do not hesitate to ask. Thank you very much. In that case, I would like to take you up on your offer. This is a brand new experience for me. So I will need to be outfitted properly for it. In other words, I will need 7th generation anti-shadow suppression dance armaments. Oh my! What a pleasant ring that has to it! I am most intrigued! Yes, I was wondering which loadout would be best. May I ask your opinion on multi-barrel rotary machine guns? They have the greatest area of effect, and the gunshot flashes will generate a lot of hype. My heart is simply a flutter at the thought. It will be quite an innovative performance. Next, I would like mounted multi-rocket launchers. I was thinking of using the recoil from firing to create a unique type of movement. I would also like some stun grenades and signal flares to give myself more options. So the risk is too high? I thought it was such a good idea. I was erring on the side of caution, but perhaps we should account for all possibilities. Let's discuss my dance armaments later. For now, I will manage with my current loadout. My combat protocols do not include dancing, but it seems I can review image data. Please allow me to consult you should the need arise. I will do the best I can. I must say, though, I am a tad disappointed. Perhaps we can still try it in private. Very well. We can just call it a one-shot test fire. Why settle for one shot when you can do two or three? I am extremely...
extremely disappointed, but very well. If Igis is not permitted to do so, then perhaps I will conduct the test on my own. Brilliant! Are you here to practice too? Seems it's true that we can dance here however we can imagine. I'm a total rookie when it comes to dancing, but if that's how it works here, I'll manage. It's not my style to just sit around waiting. The time put into practice never betrays you. At first I thought, why all of this now? But since we've committed, I shifted gears. I won't let myself slack off, even for dancing. 
I'll improve as much as I can. <laughs> Who do you think you're talking to? I'm a high school boxing champ. I've got the basics of dancing down already. Like I expected, it's all about your rhythm. That makes it easier for a boxer like me to understand. Rhythm is important for all martial arts, and especially in boxing. Find the right rhythm, and you'll eventually relax, limiting fatigue and wasted energy. By keeping in rhythm and always moving, it's easier to react quickly to an opponent. Now I know that's easier said than done, so in order to keep your... Sorry, didn't mean to get worked up. We were talking about dancing, right? Anyway, I'll stick with my own style of getting things done. That's all I can do. But I do enjoy a good party as well, so let's do our best in livening this one up. Of course, I don't intend on losing to you either. I'll be taking the champion's belt. The bell's rung and now I'm coming. Take my one-two, then an uppercut for the KO. there was nothing I could do. Well, I understand. I just wish you were here. Oh, nothing important. You know who we're talking about, though, right, Leader? What? How could you forget Koromaru? To be more accurately specific, the topic is the absence of the dog. I mean, Koromaru. You arrived in the midst of Ken exhaustively interrogating and scolding me on this point. Uh, I wasn't exactly scolding you. I just... I just feel like Koromaru is part of our team, too. In complete honesty, I planned this ball to coincide with my master's abs... I mean... It is pure, unbounded coincidence that it was arranged for such a time. Anyway, while there was a good chance that it would have posed no issues in the end, my master could have reacted strongly against admitting a quadruped guest here. In more direct terms, the thought alone made me fear for my life. It's just unfortunate is all. I'm sure Koromaru would have been a real good dancer. <gasps> How unprecedented! Do you truly mean that Fido Maru possesses an ability to dance? Well, it's Koromaru, and I would guess he's even more physically capable than we are. He should be able to dance, don't you think? I don't know if he's that good, is he? What a revelation! I was unaware that Barcoromaru had such exceptional talent! Upon deeper consideration, I now recall his persona summoning despite being quadrupedal. Not only that, but he could understand human speech and fought well alongside you all. In a sense, he could well be the most extraordinary on Poochly Pooch ever. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's true. Koromaru is pretty amazing, isn't he? Now that I envision it, the cat from the opposing team versus your dog! If only... Cat? Wait, you mean there's a cat that can dance on the other team? Yes. While somewhat overbearing, he is a fully kitted, or fully kittened, dancer. A cocky dancing cat. Nope, I can't even imagine that. Well, whatever. I already decided that I would dance enough for Koromaru's sake, too. That 
way when we return, I can pet him and say I worked hard enough for the both of us. Just so you know, I don't plan on losing to you either. You know how I was the last one in the dorm to become a Persona user? Since I joined the fight late, I really struggled to catch up to you all. But here, we all started at the same place. I'm not letting myself fall behind this time. All right, how about some practice? I've got to dance for Koromaru's sake, too. Operations complete. Give it your all, I guess. But don't go crazy or anything. I'm not done. There. I can do it. Huh. You're on fire. Full speed. <laughs> to my memory. Let's go. 
My goal is clear. <laughs> Fine by me. Well, let's begin. Just relax, Mitsuru Senpai. Not done yet. <laughs> How's that? Good. Get it out of the park! Not done yet. <laughs> the crowd's really hyped up. Yeah, the excitement here's amazing. Not bad, no? Good. Yeah, that's it. Not done yet. There. Sorry, I still don't really get what's going on here. This is a dream, right? In reality, we're all asleep in our beds, which means we're all having the same dream? And we don't have to worry about time, right? We'll forget everything when we wake up? Well, no sense in overthinking it. I'll go with the flow. 
It's scary how used to this I am. Somehow, it just feels like another day to me. A few years ago, I would have been freaking out. I adjust to things way too fast. Dancing, though? That really came out of nowhere. Nope, but nothing ventured, nothing gained, right? Oh, but I think I can picture myself doing it. I like music and I watch dance videos. What else? Uh, cheerleading? I kind of used to think that was cool. But I turned down the cheerleading club when they asked me to join. I was too embarrassed. What about you? Ever tear up the dance floor anywhere? Like at Club Escapade? Well, now I don't feel so bad. All right, let's do our best. Uh, I used to be interested in dancing, so this seems like a good chance to try it out. Honestly, I still think this is crazy, but then again, I can dance my heart out here. I'll be counting on you if something happens, okay? You seem like you can handle anything. All right. I think I'll go practice. It's our job to hype up the crowd, right? Okay, time to dance. I'm gonna be the disco queen. Huh? Is that not right? Will be easy. The spotlight's on you today. Be confident. Easy enough. How's that? All right. 
Good. I just had to join after watching you. Nice. Nice, keep it up. Nice combo. God, that's great. Whoa, you've really come a long way. I'm glad I could count on you to join me here. <laughs> How exciting this is. <laughs> that was a ton of fun. It's all due to your support. Thanks so much. You really put a lot of work in to get this far. I can tell.